Eddie Brissett of Plattsburgh, New York, sat down with us after his procedure to talk about his pain and how he came to find relief. I'm a corrections officer for uh, New York State. Um, I got hurt doing a competition. You have to do as many sit-ups, push-ups uh, as you can in two minutes, and then you have a mile and a half run. During my sit-ups, uh, about the 30, 35th sit-up, um, I heard a pop, like a shotgun going off in my back. Um, and that's basically how it all started, and that was in uh, 2006. His symptoms radiated from the center of his lumbar spine. Like many patients, he tried physical therapy, acupuncture, chiropractic care, and injections. The pain would go down to my right buttock, and at times it would go down to my right leg and right into my ankle. Uh, there's a few times where my, my ankle felt like it was broke and it was hard to walk on. Uh, the only real, um, anything that would actually help it was going to physical therapy and they'd actually put you on the, uh, kind of like an invasion table where they stretch you out. Uh, that kind of helped out with the pain in the leg, but obviously the pain would keep coming back. Seeking permanent relief, Eddie found a surgeon to perform an intradiscal electrothermal therapy, but the procedure didn't help his long-term pain. I had uh, back in 2007, what's called an IDET procedure, where they tried to go in and wrap, uh, it's like a coil around your disc, kind of seal the tear and then it would push it back in, which that seemed to help for about a year and a half, but then it obviously it, um, came back and stuff like that. I seen two other surgeons and they didn't wanna, this was in New York, uh, they didn't wanna do any surgery on me because my symptoms didn't match what the MRI showed. He went on social media to ask friends and family for their advice on what to do. Well, as soon as I posted it on Facebook, other people either came out here who had somebody else who came out uh, to the Benotney Spine Institute and I actually had it done. Actually, one of my buddies at work, his brother had it done. Same situation, he came here, he was in pain for, he said about 16 years. He was very active and um, he said he finally needed it done. Got it done and then a year later, he said he was back powerlifting and doing his regular activities again. Uh, and then I had another buddy at work who had it done. After hearing positive stories, Eddie sent his imaging to the Institute for a complimentary review and traveled to Florida for treatment. He knew that he was in the right place when Benatti surgeons were able to diagnose the issues no other facility could. The first MRI review, they kind of knew what they wanted to do, and I think that's why they wanted to see me at the Benatti Spine Institute. They actually did a few tests on me. They knew why I was getting pains down my right side. Weakness in my leg was, my left leg was smaller than my right leg and I had a lot more weakness in my left side. So they knew exactly where the, the protrusion of the disc was uh, on the nerve and why I was, that's why I was having the symptoms I was uh, getting. While in the OR, Eddie was a participant in his procedure. How are you feeling right now, Eddie? Oh, I am awesome. I'm feeling pretty good. I am feeling very good. He also volunteered to have his surgery streamed on Facebook Live, sharing real-time experiences and spreading the word like those who have gone before him. <laughs> the conscious uh, IV sedation was actually a, it was, it was good. I mean, there's nothing to worry about. It was, uh, you don't really remember a lot, but I like the idea of it because then the doctors can actually talk to you about what's going on and you can talk to them. So when there's a certain area that may be bothering you, whatever, you can tell them that, then they know that's the area that they need to go in. Whereas if you were um, and regular back surgery, obviously you're, you're out for it. So they're just going in, uh, cutting you open and hoping that they're, they're getting around that area. So I like the idea that you can talk back and forth and describe what the area is. From what I remember, I watched <laughs> some of the, some of the uh, surgery. Uh, afterwards, obviously when you, you know, uh, when you guys put it on your Facebook Live, I was able to go back to the hotel and rewatch it again and to see how the procedure goes. And, even before that, uh, which made it more comfortable for me, was I followed Benatni Spine Institute, and every day they do a live video on um, a surgery and the experience here. So you could watch it, see what type of procedures that they do on all different types of injuries to the back or neck. So when you make plans or call here, at least you know ahead of time on what to expect, which makes you feel a lot more comfortable. 
Unfortunately with many, pain has become a way of life. For Eddie, finally getting relief from his chronic pain is something that he won't forget. Just got done talking with the doctor and um, he, he said exactly um, what he did to relieve the pain, um, to give more space around my, where my nerve was. It was pinching at times and the disc was protruding. So they shaved off some of the disc and made a lot more room for my, uh, for my nerve. So yeah, as soon as I walked out, I noticed that that was gone. You know, you're pretty excited to you know get the, re the recovery uh, side of it to get back to your normal activities and do what you used to do. Uh, to deal with the pain for so long and expecting, uh, not knowing each day and what pain's going to be there or where it's going to go. Is it going to go down my leg again, down to my calf, to my uh, to my ankle? And to wake up this morning and <laughs> knowing that it's there's no twinge at all or no pain with, in that area whatsoever. Um, it's exciting to you know going forward that um, good things are about to happen. I mean, obviously when I came here, the, the one thing I wanted to do is be able to walk uh, so far without having any pain, but then you would like to get back to your normal activities, which would be gym, running. Um, I was into obstacle course racing, so I'm hoping to be able to get back into that. Eddie wants everyone to know the targeted Bonatti spine procedures end the pain. All you have to do is reach out. Just get an MRI done, and then you can just call the Bonatti Spine Institute. It's free, just send it, and they will uh, review it. They're so good on getting back to you. I sent the MRI in, and within three days, they ended up calling me back, and the doctor talked to me personally and said what he sees and that I'm a candidate, and if there's something that I would like to do, come on down. And the people here are just excellent. Um, I cannot say one bad thing. Everyone is so professional to come here and talk to the doctor one day, going over a game plan, the next day just coming in and getting surgery. Being able to walk out that same day is just unbelievable. Uh, just to have a little pain in, you know, in the decision area, but I always heard the stories of you just can't believe how much pain you're actually in until it's gone. Don't settle on just getting surgery anywhere. Or I'm telling you, just contact the Bonatti Spine Institute and you will not be disappointed when it's all said and done.